What is going on guys, Grave here. Today I'd like to talk about training gear and how there's a lot of people in the community saying that training gear should probably see some changes if the new CP changes that we see right now in the public uh, test server kind of stand and they pretty much, you know, are going to be exactly what we're hearing about now is going to be kind of the end result. Uh, before I get into all the details, be sure if you're not subscribed to the channel to hit the subscribe button. If you are a subscriber, make sure you have notifications turned on. If you enjoy the video, I'd appreciate it if you'd hit the like button. And check out everything down in the description, the community discord, my Twitter, and of course the affiliate here on the channel, GT Racing. Now we all know that the uh, new you know, update is still being tested in the public test server. And if you're on console like myself, it is a bit frustrating because you're not quite sure exactly what's going on. Unless you know, you're like myself and you read forums and Reddit and Twitter and that kind of thing. And kind of stay up to date with you know, some of the bigger personalities and in, 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 uh, in ESO, some of the you know, community developers, that kind of thing. Uh, some of the community uh, people just that you know play the game. Uh, also, you know if you if you follow the de de developers on Twitter, you can get a bit of information about exactly what's going on. And we're not sure exactly how the CP system is going to look once the public test server is done. There could be some changes, but a lot of people are concerned that 3600 PC uh, CP is going to be way too much uh, to grind out. There's even been people talking about there's really no need for them to play anymore. They're not even to 810 yet. They feel like it's going to be just even more of a grind. And in my opinion, MMOs are pretty much a grind. That's what they're made to be. But I do understand why some people are concerned that the XP rate increase that they're talking about giving with this new CP system is not going to be enough to really uh, advance your character in CP uh, to really feel like you're, you know, kind of, if you're a new player to catch up somewhat, or if you're a returning player or a person like myself has played for a long time that I'm sitting not quite at a thousand CP yet, uh, you still feel like there's going to be a lot of a grind to get to 3,600. And a lot of people have been suggesting that training gear should see some changes. Now, training gear in-game, of course, gives you extra XP for kills. And depending on what level your gear is, if it's green, you get 7%, blue is 8%, you know, purple gear is going to give you 9%, and gold gear is going to give you 10% extra XP. Now, a lot of people are saying they should change these percentages uh, and, you know, maybe 2 or 3% extra for each set or, you know, each color of gear. And that way, you know, if you have training gear on once this new CP system is out, that, you know, that would help out. In my opinion, I think they should get rid of the, you know, XP from kills, leave the percentages as they are now on training gear, and just give you XP from all yields in game. So just pretty much like when we have an XP event, you're getting extra XP for, you know, doing quest. You know, if you're playing PvP and getting kills, if you're out doing story, if you're out farming, whatever gives you XP in game, if you have that training gear on, you will get that percentage uh, for doing whatever. So once again, you would not have to change the XP percentages on the training gear. You would just have to change kind of what uh, XP you're getting. So instead of XP from kills, like I said, you get XP from all yields in game. And I think that would be a big help uh, kind of, you know, for people that want to go out and just farm CP, you know, they kind of want to level up a little quicker, get their character built up a little bit stronger. I think that would be a little bit better, in my opinion, than just, you know, going extra percentages on the kill XP game. Uh, leave me a comment with your thoughts, guys. Uh, I'm kind of curious to see what everybody thinks. I've seen, like I said, I've been seeing a lot of people, whether they play on PC or console, talking about changes to training gear, changes to really just changes uh, in XP in general when this new system is released. So leave me a comment with your thoughts, and I'll catch you all next time. Peace.